Welcome back, survivors. This is Chububo1, and you're watching Let's Play Arc Extinction. And, uh, yep, I've changed armor. I took almost all the black pearls that I had uh, at the time. I've gotten a few more since then. But, yeah, I crafted some, some tech armor. It looks pretty sweet. And, uh, I've been pretty busy. You know, since the last episode, of course, it's been, for me, oh, there's, you know, hitting wrong buttons. For me, it's it's been a while, oops, since I recorded. And you can see, I've been working on the base a lot, a whole lot. Um, it has become this crazy maze of staircases <laughs> that go everywhere. Uh, so I can pretty much get around anywhere that I want on the base or from the ground to anywhere on the base. Um, and even over here to the greenhouse. Well, uh, let's let's take a look. We'll hop on tab. Or we will just miss completely. So I completed this section down here, and I walled it off. I redid the plumbing that was not making me happy. Uh, I did not wall this off, otherwise I'd block access to this stairwell and block access from coming from that direction. But you see I walled off all the other pillars, which was not really what I intended to do at first. But then once I was started, it's like I don't know where to stop, and it was ridiculous. It took a long time. Uh, all this is now walled off and completed. And we've even got walls up above the uh, dino gates. Thanks to some help from Discord. Uh, for just a really obvious thing that I was missing. Uh, but yeah, it's like a giant maze of stairwells. Let me get up here and look down. Uh, so it's pretty crazy. Definitely the biggest thing I've ever built. Um, the top and bottom are not connected except for this stairwell. And uh, I'm, I may connect them. Uh, I Actually, I don't think I can because there is a big metal structure in between the two. So um, I don't guess I will be connecting them. Uh, anyway, so enough about this junk. Oh, oh wait, there is one more thing about this junk. Uh, I did I did clean up the inside, this back corner, uh, which I did not like, which um, just looked messy because it wasn't finished. So I've moved, where did I move in there? Well, my armor in there, which I'm fixing to outgrow that. I made it easy out right there. And up here on the second floor, uh, I have the trophies that I've collected so far. Just isn't very many. I'm going to need a whole lot more. And uh, I had to move the bed, so I thought I might as well just go ahead and make it a, a nicer looking bed. Um, but anyway, so I, I am I'm kind of pleased with the way that it worked itself out in the end. Uh, especially that part. Um, and I've got plenty of room here in the middle, which is where I think I'm going to stick the uh, my artifacts, my display artifacts, you know, later. And all the stairs and stuff. I don't know. It kind of reminds me of... It kind of makes me think I should have been building Helm's Deep from Lord of the Rings or something like that. With all those walls and stairs. Uh, anyway, we got a lot to do today. Hit the wrong way already. And uh, what I want to do today is do some big game hunting. Um, I need a couple of gigas. Preferably a male and a female. And I need a couple of RGs. Again, male and female. We're just going all Noah style today. And probably a couple of Uteranuses. Um, again, male and female. 
Uh, so I can start building up some armies. Uh, I need an Argentavis army. Uh, I want to build a Giga army because I've never done that before. And uh, I need I need a good high level Uteranus. There's some serious lag. Some a high level Uteranus uh, to help keep the Gigas uh, keep them encouraged. You know during the fights. Uh, and so we're going to start with the Gigas, and they are over here in the snow biome. And I've also got kind of a plan of action, you know, as far as what we're doing on Extinction. You know, we're going to tame those, we're going to raise up some armies. Uh, I might hit a few more drops. Uh, I did hit a blue and a yellow. Didn't get that great of stuff. Um, I, I did another element vein. Didn't get as much as the first time. Um, but I want to get uh, some of these things tamed up and bred so we can run the caves and get an artifact for the base. And then after I've done that, then start defeating the titans because they drop uh, huge amounts of loot. Uh, hopefully good loot and so we're gonna loot the Titans and then we will tame the Titans and then prepare to face the King Titan um, we'll see how that goes but uh, Gigas hang around the outskirts of the snow biome and just inside the snow biome and I I think I've got the stuff yes to say, don't make me go back. Um, I have the stuff for a Giga Trap, and we'll talk about it once we get there and find a Giga. And <laughs> oh man, I forgot the Trinks and the Kibble. So I'll bring you back once I have everything and I find a Giga. Par for the course, right? Alright, finally, I found the first Giga of the day. And a lot of trouble. I couldn't even tell what level it was, though. It's like the spyglass. There we go. A female, level 15. Uh, so I need to find some place a little far away to build the trap because they are insanely fast. <laughs> you know, I can't English anymore. I've decided that my ability to English is, is gone. Maybe is overrated. Uh, however, huge shout out to um, Discord user MXZF. Yep, that's his name. Or her name. I don't know. MXZF. Uh, who gave me a screenshot of this uh, particular uh, kind of Giga Trap. Because uh, it was, as far as Giga Traps go, it was cost very few materials. Um, lightweight, super effective. Uh, also low imprint, or low footprint, you know, which, I mean, uh, it didn't stick out a whole lot. Um, which I had a hard time finding the one that I made on the island. <laughs> you know, after I made it. Uh, but we're gonna we're gonna use it here. It involves um, well, you know, I'll just tell you after I'm done about that. All right, so here's what the trap sort of looks like. Uh, it's a triangular metal base because gigas can bust through anything less than metal, uh, metal door frame, and a slanted triangle roof. So triangle base, triangle roof, and it's pointed inward. And then I use uh, two thatch 
foundations for spacing, and then I build another one to that foundations and so on, and eventually it connects to itself. Uh, but now we need to get rid of the thatch. And the way this works is uh, you kite the Giga into, come on, into the trap. And because the roots are angled upward, um, the Giga can go over the roofs this way, but then uh, can't get back out because they're angled against the Giga. And at least on the island, uh, they got stuck. So uh, that's what it looks like from the sky. So you see it's really small. And then you just get kind of safely away and start shooting. All right, uh, Lord help us. This is gonna hurt. Is, you know, what I'm concerned about, really. Wait, I want to keep that. Keep that. Keep those. Uh, a couple of those. And dump the rest. I've seen a few T-Rexes. But it's not what we're shopping for today. Hey, there you are. Yeah. So, yeah, this is going to hurt. That gig is going to take a chomp out of me. My health is going to nosedive. Hey, look. It's some tasty chicken delivered right to you. You want that? Yep. You want me? No, you want more of me. Oh. Oh, man. Okay, hang on. <laughs> uh, you know what I forgot to do? Forgot to put you crazies. You know, I'm, I'm shopping for you, too. I can't see you. Oh, well. Later. Later. There's bigger game in the big game episode to tame right now. Nope, land. You flung done? Can't have you slowing us down, buddy. But thank you for your support. Well, you didn't slow us down. You slowed down the Gigo with your mighty poop. I'll keep your berries. Alright, you. Passive. Okay, now we might have a clue what we're doing. Not really, you know. As usual, this is all fly by the seat of your pants kind of stuff. Alright, let's try again. I don't want that chicken. I want this chicken that's on the ground. That's right. Yeah. You're a big boy. Wait, you're a female, aren't you? I don't want you. You're slowing me down, though. Quit hurting. Hey, ADHD Dino, I'm over here. I'm the shiny. Come get the shiny. Not you. I might have tamed you. Oh, no, I wouldn't have. You're level two. Whoa, hello. Hello. Great. You're doing fantastic. You're doing fantastic. And Oh look at you. Aw, are we stuck? 
We are stuck. Whoa, we are stupid. <laughs> I wanted to be on the rock. And I jumped off. Okay, see how he's stuck? Yeah, this is the part where we pray that he stays stuck. Or she. What are you? Here, eat some drinks. Right in the noggin. And shoot you in the eyeball. Oh, Desert Eagle, get out of the way. Okay, now we're gonna slow down a little bit. Trap, it's hard to tell if they're trying to get away or not. So just slow down my shots. I had to make more trank arrows when I went back for all the other stuff. Oh. Running. Alright, that's a good sign. a dire wolf. How did, how did you not kill me? Desert Eagle. Right. Oh, neutral. Oh, I'm sorry. One thing I do remember is their torpor goes down crazy fast. Yeah, see, look at that. And come on. Access inventory. Access inventory. Here's the head. You let me access inventory here. Here, 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 there. Seriously? Twenty narcotics. I can only hope that she uh, wakes before Torpor goes down. It's still going up for the moment, so that's good. bring you back if uh, she tames up or if something goes horribly wrong. Oh, she's up! Yes! Only one kibble. That's amazing. And the 20 narcotics did the job. Look at you. Such a big girl. Such a big girl. Let's do 
bad it's dark. <laughs> yeah, I did. I took a screenshot. All right. Um, I guess we have a female, level 15. I mean, the one I have on the island is literally well, when I tamed him. Him? I don't know if it's him or not. Oh. Tech suit for the win. Um, so I'm pretty sure he's a level one. So, we shall uh, continue the search for a mate. So, I will, I will bring you back when I find another. Okay, uh, I've made a great discovery in the midst of doing something really dumb. I uh, was afraid I wasn't going to have enough trank darts, and I may not. So I thought, well, I'll make a bow and arrow, make some trank arrows, which means I had to make some narcotics, anyway, etc., etc. So I finally finished all that and flew right out here, and lo and behold... Where to go? You're gonna make a wire out of me. <laughs> uh, there was a male Giga right here. I promise it was a level five. Oh, there he is. See? So I think this this point right here on the map. Uh, if you're looking at the map, looking at the map, it's kind of that bottom right corner of the snow biome. Just on the edge of the snow biome. Uh, I do have my GPS. Because I put my Giga Trap. Um, I put its coordinates in the phone. So there are the coordinates. And uh, so this, this may be like a Giga spawning spot. And although level 5 is not what I wanted... I would wanted something higher between this and the level 15. Maybe we can come up with something workable for an army. Okay, we have this tension. Here we go again. Terrible screenshot. It's not even interested in me. Hey, come over here. That's right. Come on, buddy. Go up the hill. Flying through your tail. You need to come get me. from the last the last giga we played with my friend. Uh, and I did not put Desert Eagle on passive, so I'm going to fly way over here.
since he's a level 5, hopefully he won't take as many Trank Darts. Right between the eyes. That's not good. Time to play right now. More? Another rock. Or should I a rock? Yeah, you guys stop it. Messing up my team. Let's do it like this. <laughs> this was worst case scenario. Uh, drink arrows on the bow. Let's equip the bow. Hi. How are you? Be a cool shot. There you go. And he's down. He's down. is like just screaming down uh, here take drugs drugs and food one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve eight, nine, twenty eight, nine, twenty all right torpor is going up 
And uh, I will bring you back when he's up. Shouldn't take as long. up. Alright, so there we go. And uh, hopefully between the two we can get some good good stats. Melee damage, 25%. Oh, that's a joke, right? Is that a joke? Um, yeah, that could be a problem. Thirty five percent. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll figure it out later. And uh, I am going to head back to the base. Because I'm going to need some more... Some more Trank darts. Yeah, give me that back. And some more... Um, I just can't think of anything right now. Some more narcotics. Anyway, so we got us a couple of gigas. Uh, we'll see how they do once we uh, get them bred and stuff like that. I'm going to leave the giga trap here. I've put the coordinates in my phone. So if I need more gigas, I know where to go. I wonder if there's one out here already. Heading back home. Alright, here we are, back at the base. And... Driving like a maniac. Alright, so let's see... Well, you know, before we take the gigas out... Um... Wrong button. Let's take a look at... Uh, let's make some saddles. I'll, I'll probably have to relearn the Ingram because it's been a long time since I've done anything with Gigas. Been a couple of maps. Giga. Yep. Alright. And I forgot to look at what I needed to make that saddle. <laughs> uh, first one, maybe? Maybe? Nope. Glomasaur. Megalo. I hate this part. I hate it. Giga. So we, we need... Well, we have already have the fiber. 680 hide. We've got that. And 120 metal. That's fine, but I'm going to need twice that, so I'm going to need another 350 fiber. I'm going to need, so what's that, 12, 1300 hide? Okay, that that's going to be a lot. And basically one st stack of 300 metal ingots, which that shouldn't be a problem. I don't know. Okay, that's why I have gotten some fiber. Get lots of fiber, kids. Uh, let's see. Metal stack. Check. Oh, now we're now we're encumbered. That's okay, cause we're wearing tech armor. You know what you can do with tech armor when you're encumbered? You can. You can, you can flail blindly. You can move. Ta-da! So I need. What was it? Thirteen hundred. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. 
says I'm encumbered. But no, I'm not. Am I close enough? I am close enough. <laughs> Throw all this in here. You, you, you. This be the first of many saddles, I'm afraid. Uh, yep, make two. Interesting. Who did that? <laughs> uh, who who dropped a dead pariser on my doorstep? Did you do that? Let's see, are you on neutral? You're on passive. Was it you? Was it you? Are you on neutral? Passive. Oh well. I guess we'll never know who killed the pairs. And so let's. I forgot what I was doing. I was so distracted by the pairs. Oh yeah, we're gonna look at the gigas. See what they look like out here in the sun instead of the snow. There's one. They look amazing. Look at that. Such beauty. Such craftsmanship. <laughs> if anybody old is watching this and played Mech Warrior 2, um, that's, that's what that reminds me of. Oh, no, not so much now. Alright, you're the level 22, so I'm guessing you were the... You were the female. Yep. You were the male. You both look a uh, very boring gray. Is this true? Are you guys boring? Kind of a kind of a weird beigey color. You're kind of a gray brown. Okay, that's different. I think my giga on the island is green. I, I really don't remember. That well. All right, let's let's go ahead and slap a saddle on you. Yeah, don't you gurgle at me? I'm gonna slap a saddle on you. Sweet. And there we go. Nope, we're not gonna level you up. <laughs> Let's go say hi to the neighbors. I like don't have any neighbors anymore. Seems like everything has uh, left them. Whereas it's just not responding right on the map. Very 
odd. Oh, there's somebody. There's somebody we can say hello to. Hey there, piggy piggy. We killed the fish, but we didn't kill the pig. Get him. Oh, you're sneaky. Except we glitched right through that. Huh. Wow. That wasn't anywhere close to my mouth. It wasn't anywhere close to me, and I killed it. <laughs> Poor little dimorphic. <laughs> Within a quarter mile of the bite of a giga, you're gonna get some. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 19, 19 levels. Even the saddle dwarfs me. Oh, no, 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 don't crash. I already know what I'm going to name these guys because uh, they're breeders. I mean, that's what I got them for. I'm going to use them for breeding. Already out of stand. Um, hmm. Can't go that way. So their names aren't too terribly important or. It's, it's not important to me that they have creative or fun names since they're just going to be breeders and they're just going to be standing around the whole time or once I've used these two if I can get back over the other one look I can see them from here I'm kind of curious how big they are compared to the wyvern but um, they're just going to be standing around most of the time so you know they don't need super creative names but just something so um, you can trace their lineage. And and that may be a whole episode, is reading Gigas, because I've never done that before. Right. But there you go. Giga next to Wyvern. Giga bigger than Wyvern. Interesting. I know you can do this on a Giga, though. You can stand up. <laughs> so uh, we are going to go ahead and end the episode um, we've only made it a third of the way through of getting the stuff that I wanted uh, we, we got RGs we gotta get I need at least one Uteranus um, preferably two and uh and this took way longer than I expected it to. So, I'll actually, oh, I was going to name them, wasn't I? I'm sorry. Let's do that. Oh, you know, okay, let's, let me do official sign. We'll do official sign off, and then I'll name them, and then, then we'll go. So, thanks for joining me today, and thanks for the views. Thanks for watching. That means the same thing. Thanks for the likes and the comments. And uh, go have some fun, and I'll catch you next time. Right now, we got to name somebody. Options. No, 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 no. Uh, change name. This is this is the female, so this is going to be Granny Extinction Giga. Yep, you're welcome. And you, my friend, are a moving target. Oh, and we made it. Look. 
Come on. Options. Change name. Grandpa Extinction Giga. Of course. There. No, you guys are not allowed to level up. And because that will just make things complicated later. Yep. Don't ignore me when I'm talking to you. <laughs> 